Hello, my dear Cancer. Welcome to a new reading. The good things coming towards you, Cancer. You are here for a reason, something that you need to be aware of. That's why you are here with me. So let's see what your cards will tell you. Cancer, if you are new here, please consider to subscribe. Welcome. So good to have you on my channel. Join the mystical community. If you are an old friend, welcome back. So happy to have you here with me again. So, Cancer, let's see what go what is going on with you here. First card, do not be frustrated. Okay. Do not be frustrated, Cancer. Look at this. Ah, you are a work of art. You are so creative. You are so capable, Cancer. Seek. <laughs> you are about to, or you already discovered what you want to do with your life. Now, believe it or not. Now that self-confidence you need to work on and also you need to have certain boundaries within your mind, you know. Cancer, let's see the good things coming towards you. All right. Okay. The key card. That's beautiful. A breakthrough. You also have the tracks. Steady forward movement. There is one way. The way towards a big success here for you, Cancer. I think I can. Look at this. What did I told you? Believe that you can because you can is not a lie. It's not an illusion. Yes, you can. And there is something with a person that you are dealing with here. Whoever this person is, this might be someone that you recently um met this person is someone who can especially if he's a man someone who can help you with your life purpose someone who can help you to achieve great things here someone that will help you to grow wow okay this is beautiful cancer So let's take the tarot. Let's take the tarot and let's mix, shuffle these cards a little bit. So, the good things coming towards Cancer. So, solutions, opportunities, more um, of a clear mind, um, clarity as you are on a new journey here. And uh, if you are, you just start a new journey in your life right now, a new job, maybe a new school, and you're like, is this the right path for me? Is this what I meant to do? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. And there is someone here helping you out to succeed, to really make, uh, make it in life. Now, let's see what the tarot will tell you, my dear Cancer. Right off the bat, Queen of Pentacles. Now, Queen of Pentacles represents a working parent. You can be this person um, putting a lot of effort into, you know, creating stability for your family in your home. Uh, very nurturing energy, making sure that everyone has everything that they need. Let's see. So, as you have this great desire of having a better life, having more money, having more things to offer for your family, for your home, an opportunity is being given to you. So, as you are thinking, how can I make more money? How can I make things better for my family, for my home? How can I achieve all these things? As you are feeling frustrated because maybe there are not yet the results that, that you need, right? You don't get the money that you need. You don't, you don't see, have a clear vision, not yet. As you are struggling with this, the opportunity is coming. All right, you have this 
this is the ace of uh, this is a, the the hand of ace of cups right so it's like when you are looking at your life and all the things it's like something is missing there is something here that you need maybe you need a better job maybe you don't have a job at all right so as you are looking at all the things that are happening into your life and wondering how you can make things better how you can have this achievement in your life then the key is coming the solution is coming so let's see a little bit more about this the empress don't stop working don't stop being active even though you know in your mind is like you have the vision you know you know you can do this you know you can be better have a better job you can make it you can be successful as you know that in your mind keep doing the work keep um keep uh, being active because the results will come the breakthrough will happen and either you will connect here with uh, a person that will can be a person or more or you are entering into a space where you are going to um, you know to be with like-minded people um, a place where you will be able to grow and to really discover your true self and you are someone so capable and so creative and so um, skillful um, with the empress here the empress she has the, the the power to create life and i feel like you have the power to to change your life and to bring all these good things in your life everything that is missing can be achieved by um, not giving up and you know don't give up um, especially when adversity comes don't give up when times are hard then it's like you are being tested are you going to give up or keep going through and you will go through and you it's like you show that you know mm, you have a million reasons to be down but you go against that and you keep fighting and this is something uh, that will bring you this um this amazing opportunity here cancer so uh, do know that things will get better for you and definitely you will be successful and you will be able to <laughs> look at this ace of wands and you will be able to take care of your home of your family to to provide because for some of you this uh, is something that is deeply in your mind how to provide how to have everything that you need for yourself for your family and you will see that you will find solutions and remember steady forward movement keep moving forward now you know there is there is here a potential new beginning but let me let me put my my thoughts into into <laughs> into a place because i get a lot of things here so first of all you have this um this opportunity this gift coming towards you you see now it's it's something new that might scare you don't be scared keep moving forward when the opportunity is coming take it this is something that you've been manifesting so take it don't be afraid of change because this might be something new that you are not that use with it or you don't have enough experience everything can be learned cancer just go with it this is your opportunity to grow so go the distance this is one way towards success so 
when you got this opportunity, go for it. Even though you are not truly prepared, um, you will learn. You are so um, you are someone who can learn easy. So don't let uh, the new or the unknown to scare you. Okay. Now also with this four of pentacles, you have this maybe difficulty of you know stepping into new things but life will push you with the four of pentacles here dare to step out of the comfort zone uh, dare to enter into a new into a new company into a new phase in your life whatever this new event is go with it because if you hold on tight and you are like i don't want to change i don't want to try something new i'm afraid then Nothing will happen. Did you get stuck where you are? And you deserve so much more. So don't hold too tight. Don't close yourself. Don't limit yourself. This is this is what I was looking for. The 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 word limit. Don't limit yourself. Two cards here. Let's see. Haha. <laughs> Of course, look at this. I don't even have to, <laughs> I don't even have to say anything. The cards are speaking for themselves. What you have when I said don't limit yourself? You have Eight of Swords and the Nine of Swords. Both of these two cards are showing how powerful our mind is. It's so easy to say, to stay into this. It's easy because when you are in this mindset, uh, when you are feeling like so worried and so negative, right? It's like everything goes against me. Nothing goes well for me. Uh, so on, so on, so on. Sometimes it's easy to be in this stage in our lives than to say, you know what? I refuse to be here. You know what? I might have to spend some money. I don't have any. I don't have money. And the small amount that I have, I still have to spend something. And I will because I want to get this done. Because I want to move forward. Because I know I can be in a better place. I can do more with my life. So fighting all the negative thoughts, it, it's what you need to do right now. Eight of Swords, this is a choice to be here. Eight of Swords is overthinking of situ a situation. Believing that you are all tied up here and you cannot get away. Yes, you can. These swords are not that big, are not, um, are not that many. There is a way out if you look for it. The wind is blowing her hair in her eyes, but she can take... You know, she's choosing to hold her hands at the back like she's all tied up. She's not... This is your choice to, to be this way, to be in this place. Don't let your fears to grow. Look at this, this monster. It's not real. This is unfounded fear, Cancer. Fear is just our, us supposing that things will go this way and that way. Fear is not real. So... Don't give so much of your time, of don't give so much of your energy thinking of what might happen, trying to figure it out of all the bad things that happen to you in life. No, you refuse to be in this mindset and you say, you know what, I let go of all of this, I deserve better, I better focus on constructive thoughts, I better read a book or learn something than to just sit here and cry that for all the bad things that are happening to me. So everything is in the perspective cancer. So the good things is, the, another good thing that is coming towards you is that, you know what? You change your perspective and you not say, I cannot do this, always happens to me this way. You say, I can do this. Look at this. I think I can. I'm on the right track. There is no other way. I just have to keep moving forward. 
let's take your last set of cards and let's see what other good things are coming here now the people that you are working with the people that you are met are not there to are not your competition only if you look at them in this way cancer five of wands for me here shows that you are maybe entering into a space where people the other people want to achieve what you want to achieve so isn't it easy to you know to become to collaborate than to go against each other ten of wands shows that there is a lot of responsibility on your shoulders that it's a lot of hard work and you you are doing it and you are totally capable of doing it but also things can be easier for you when you change your your uh, uh, way of looking of the people that you are working with and instead of looking at them like your um, competition look like your partners hey we are all into this let's let's help each other learn from them don't look at them like competition you know because every person that you meet in this life cancer has something to teach you you can learn from every person in your life something but you have to be open to that you know you have to really be open to that no one is an enemy everyone has something to offer you and you know, start. you start being the good person. Look at this. As you, as you make small things, you will see that when you show to someone a kindness, you, you teach them how to treat you. So I get this feeling that the good that you come comes back to you with the Six of Pentacles. You will see that... Um, Something here is going to be given to you. And the only two, you see it's an interesting six of pentacles in the, um, in the classic tarot. There are two people, right? And the only one is getting the coin. Now here, it's only you. So be good, do good, be helpful. And uh, you will see that someone will notice your kindness and they will repay you they will reward you for your kindness for your efforts even though you feel small look you may feel like a child you may feel um like no i don't do that i don't um, say anything because i'm too small i'm not significant in this maybe company in this group don't say that to yourself cancer because maybe the the, the advice that you give to someone will come to someone else's ears. They will hear about what you did and they will decide to help you also. So it's all about balance. It's all about the good that you, the, the action that you put out there. You know, when, when you do something, you send something into the universe, it will come back to you. That's why I'm saying the good that you do will come back to you. Always always and this is something that you need to hear and i feel like it, you will change your perspective of uh, dealing with people in your life and this is going to be so beneficial you will see wow look at this the sun card this will be so beneficial this will bring so much light uh, in your in your life so much good things will happen to you because of uh, the new attitude the new way of looking and acting um, in your life with the people in your life uh, cancer is just wonderful so the good things that are coming to you you are about to to transit you know from feeling frustrated feeling uh, being in the darkness feeling like nothing goes your way of you know exactly the opposite coming into the sun having the right people by your side that help you to grow to to su very supportive of your purpose life purpose of your um passions maybe so 
there is only one way moving forward and you are on the right way. So um, put aside the negativity and draw those limits. You can do it and you will do it. Uh, staying and being negative will not help you anyway, right? So why we, you should waste any any time of your life thinking um, uh, negatively about uh, something. No, take only the, the positive thoughts and fight with all the challenges that you go through, you will go through and you will set up yourself for success here and you will uh, meet the right people. Some of you, you are ready, you are in a community, you are in a company and someone is watching you. It's like waiting to see what you are made of, what you can offer, what you are good at. So put yourself out there. Don't look like there are competition. No, look at these people as your friends, how you can help them. Because being helpful, you will attract someone's attention and they will want to help you other uh, also. And like this, you will create the life that you want. And like this, you will enter into this empress energy where you will uh, create everything uh, that you always wanted. It's not like it's going to fall from the sky for you, Cancer. You will create you will be the one who will bring all of this uh, good things in your life. So my dear Cancer, this is your reading. This is what I see for you in this moment. I really hope you enjoyed and was helpful. If you did, don't forget to write me in the comments below. I would love to hear from you. To give a thumbs up not only helps me uh, to spread the message, but also it's so good to see interaction for from you. Uh, makes me very happy and makes me keep going with what I'm doing here on the channel. Thank you so much, Cancer, for all your support. And I wish you all the best. Be strong and love and light.